Hey guys, I'm Zig, I'm a gamer, and you're watching Z Gamer. This is my first video, and for this video, I thought I'd play some Minecraft, as it's quite a popular game, and I thought you guys might enjoy it. I'm gonna play a creative flat world with mob spawning turned off, just to sort of mess around with building and, and redstone. Um, also, I would like to mention, I know I do have an annoying voice, I would like it if you wouldn't know if you wouldn't mention it in the uh, comment section although you should leave a friendly comment maybe about how good this video was and remember to like and subscribe to my channel uh what should we call this world my redstone testing that's eh, that works testing world okay so I'm going in, I'm gonna start out with a bit of redstone, then I might try building something. Also I would like to mention anybody watching this video, if there's any content you want to see then just tell me. I'm gonna pause for a second and read out a list of games I'm willing to play. Okay, so I have Cat Goes Fishing, Circle Empires, Clone Run in the Danger Zone, Dome Keeper Demo, um, Feed and Grow Fish, Forager, Forts, Happy Room, The Henny Stickman Collection, Learn to Fly 3, Muck, um, Octageddon, People Playground, Phasmophobia, Plague Inc, Rounds, SCP Containment Breach, SCP Secret Laboratory, Civilization 6, Slime Rancher, Spore, Stacklands, Subnautica, Team Fortress 2, Terraria, Terratech, Timberborn, um, Town of Salem, Undertale, and Vampire Survivors. Also, if there are any other games that you know of that are either free or cheap, I might be willing to get some of them. And I do have a couple of friends I can play with. So I'm going to start out just by building some basic redstone machines. So I'm going to grab some redstone, some repeaters. I should actually be grabbing one of each. Um, I'll grab a piston. And... Yeah. Okay. So what should I build first? First, I've got to grab some stone so I can build a stone. Uh, am I blind or is there no stone? I see infested stone, stone. Should it not be at the top? Does that not make sense? There's infested stone. There's normal stone. Okay. Um, I would like to mention I am on the Bedrock Edition of the game. I can go on to Java and I have a decent mod loader. It's not the greatest though. So, yeah. Uh, for anybody who doesn't know, I'm going to show a basic tutorial of redstone and how it works. So, first you have to lay down your redstone dust. You can lay it in a line and like in a square if you want. And basically when you put something like a redstone torch or a redstone block next to it, it emits a signal and you can see the signal going along. So if I, I'll show you the redstone block. If I grab some redstone lamps as well, I can put them next to this and the further along they go, eventually the signal will will run out so if I put this all the way down this line I think that should be long enough if I put this torch here the signal goes all the way along I put the I'm supposed to put the redstone on top of the lamps I'm sorry also I would like to mention again this is my first video so please show some love in the comments I could really use I could really use it um, and yeah, so if you look here, the redstone, if you look at the color of the redstone, right here, it's 
sort of bright, but as it goes, it gets darker and darker until it starts powering things. By the way, this one isn't powering anything either. It's just that um, the things go one over, so if I were to break this, that one would still be powered. It's a bit strange. Um, I'm going to break this now. Why am I doing it like that? Why is it doing that? Okay, there. Let me grab some glass to replace that. Um, so that's basically what redstone is. Different things do different things. So as you saw, the lamps light up when they're given redstone. The pistons can push other blocks like this. So if I put a stone or two stone there, then it'll push it forward. And because this is a sticky piston, it pulls one back, the one it's touching. Um, but I'm not going to do an in-depth um, explanation. Uh, I don't really know how long I want this video to be. It's been pretty long already. Um, also, I would like you guys to tell me if you would like uh, more frequent but less edited, like non-edited or very little editing on my videos, or if you would like uh, more frequent, no, would you like more frequent and less edited, or less frequent and more edited? What am I going to build? I'm not great at redstone, I'll admit that, but I'm not bad, so I've actually not built one of these, so I'm going to try and build a redstone pulse extender. It's something that I feel like I should learn how to do. So, to my knowledge, you add redstone here, then a ton of these, and they all have to be flicked on. Then redstone like that. More of these all flipped on. And then one here. Let's see if that works. If I do this. I mean, that sort of works. Is the power getting weaker each time? It is. Okay, in that case, I don't know what I did wrong. So, let's just try that. No, that's not right. What if I turn them all off? And do it. Um this nope oh wait i think it's supposed to be constantly powered if i turn that on no um maybe these are repeaters instead let's try changing these to repeaters and i'll just have the one comparator there Nope. I'll replace that if I turn the comparator like that. Nope. Um, okay. So I'm going to pause the video right here, do a bit of research to see how it works, and then try. I don't think you caught that last click. I clicked pause too early. I'm going to do a bit of research and then try building one. Okay, so although this isn't... Am I not... Am I paused? No, I'm not. Um, although this isn't done much research, I believe the thing I was doing was I just don't need that one comparator in the middle, but again, I'm not certain. Let me just check one more thing here. It is like that. Okay. So I'm just going to try this to see if this works. It does not. Okay. In that case, I'm just going to move on to another project. Let's clear my inventory. And I'm going to grab some building material. I'm not good at building either. What I basically do when I'm playing Survivor Minecraft is I just make farms. I really enjoy that type of stuff. But what should I build? I'm going to try and build a beehive. That's going to be pretty big. Uh, what else could I use? 
I'll use some gold. I'm gonna grab raw gold, but I doubt I'll use it. Um, let's just start with the building. So first, I'm gonna put a beehive. And I'm gonna try and make it so that if you... It's gonna be in a tree, so I've gotta grab a sapling and some bone meal. And I'm gonna try and use a command block to make it so that if you teleport into the corner of the beehive, like the top corner, it will just teleport you straight into the hive. Oh wait, wrong thing. I need this. Oh. That's why. Um, that tree's too small. I'll just move over here. There we go. So if I put a nest there, then I should be able to make it so that if you teleport into like here with an ender pearl, you'll end up in here on a pressure plate. So, uh, I'd have to move this up one. It's fine. I'm just going to start building. I'm actually decent at commands. I'm nothing like some of the more popular YouTubers like Mr. Cat. But I'm not bad at it. Uh, what shape is the inside of a beehive? I know it's uh, like a honeycomb pattern in hexagons. I don't even know how to build a hexagon. Hexagon is six sides, so it would be one, two, three, four, five, six. No, that's an octagon. So, one, two, so that's four, which means this is one, two, th that's eight. One, two, but it's, I don't know how to build a hexagon in Minecraft. I'm probably just going to cheap out and be build an octagon. I'm just going to leave all of that mess and start building, so... I'm actually going to fill the floor in with commands, so slash fill there, to, let's do over this way, here, honey, nope, that's honey, honeycomb block, there we go, and then, let's see, I'm just going to try and make this sort of even. I hope you guys are enjoying the video so far. I would like to remind you again to like and subscribe. And I know it's quite annoying having me reminding you. Be and I know that because I watch a lot of YouTube personally. But I would like to mention as a creator, I know that it is a very important thing. Like... While it is annoying to you, if you would just go down below the video and subscribe, it would be so much for me. And it's literally one click for you. You don't even have to, like, put on notifications. I really don't mind. How many blocks is this? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. I'm going to shave this to 15 blocks each day. Which means this should be 15. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. So it was a square, but not good. I want 15 by 15, which means it should be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. And here should be the middle if I counted correctly. Yeah, that looks like the middle. So I'm now gonna start building up this beehive. I really don't know the shape that they're in, so I'm just gonna try. Um, after I eat, I'm probably gonna give up on this. I'm gonna say that now. I might continue it in a uh, in another video or pause this video and continue the recording but I'm definitely not finishing it tonight it's currently 1am which isn't very good um, so yeah I'm probably going to turn it off soon but I'm just going to try and get the base for this beehive done
it shouldn't be too difficult with the design I'm going for. So I'm just going to do like a basic beehive design where the like the floor is a little low. In fact, if I lifted this off, I, I might actually do that. So slash clone there, there, there to it's up here into and then yeah so if I click slash clone that I don't know what any of this is one two three four five six is that not enough? Um, in that case, maybe if I just go up and do this. Yeah, that works. Okay. And I'm now going to clear this area. Sorry, my mouse is pretty bad. I My mouse pad isn't here right now I left it somewhere I'm gonna probably have it by tomorrow or the day after though there we go and I'll just delete this little bit and that so I'm gonna continue building and I'm also gonna go in three on the bottom one two three and do this that's four what is it no it's three um i'm sorry uh there are a few games that i would like to play on steam rather than minecraft i don't tend to play minecraft very much and that will probably change if that's what you guys want to see because i'm going to base most of what i play around what you guys want to see um, but yeah, there are a few games on Steam that even if you guys aren't particularly interested in it, I'm gonna post a couple of videos on anyway, like Domekeeper and Vampire Survivors, which are both very good and cheap or free games. Although Domekeeper is currently in a demo and I expect it to cost money by the time it, co by the time it comes out. Um, also if anybody's interested in giving me new games to record then I'm happy to like if they're not too expensive I'm happy to buy them and play them um there oh my god I hate building upwards it always throws me off okay there we go so now it's like that that's good enough I should probably build them a bit different in terms of how like how thick they are how tall like how high they are on the y on the y axis but it's fine i'll just leave it like this and pretend it doesn't exist one of the main things i intend to use minecraft for not minecraft sorry youtube for is just to improve my skills at any of the games i play because it's going to encourage me to play them more if you guys enjoy it. So anything that you guys enjoy, I'm going to get better at. Which is nice because I like being good at games, but I also like enjoying them. So as long as I have something that's making me want to get good at them, I'm like, I'm very willing to. I just don't immediately think about it. I tend to think about just playing it in a friendly way. Like I said earlier, my Minecraft worlds are mainly based around just making uh, casual little farms. And although I play in, like, in survival normal, like, no cheats, I just, I don't really do anything other than farming. It's not like I cheat the farms in or anything. I don't do any of that stuff. Although I do tend to get some pretty OP items. Other, like, I tend to have stone or iron but I also have like max enchants on them because for anybody who didn't know, fishing is one of the most OP things in Minecraft because it can drop you enchanted books with like 
the best enchanted book I think I've gotten was I got a Mending Unbreaking 3 Protection 3 book once. And, oh, actually, I did get Sharp 5 Fire Aspect 1 as well. I've gotten some really good stuff from fishing, and the best part about it is that it's so relaxing. Like, you can put on a show in the background and just listen to whatever you want while you sit there fishing. And it's sort of like what it is in real life, except the for it's missing the only downside of doing it in real life for me, which is the... Um, the being outdoors, like I really don't like the the wetness or the sand flies and mosquitoes. Um, in the area in the area I live, we have a lot of bugs as well. So yeah, it's really annoying being outside. So I like that I can do the calming fishing, but like inside. Although I do live near a reef and I enjoy fishing on the reef. Although most areas are green zones now, most areas that we go to. Uh, ooh, once... I don't know if you guys want to keep hearing my stories. In the end of this episode, in the comments, uh, feel free to comment whether you like, like, whether you would like listening to stories or if you'd prefer just, um, prefer me just talking about the gameplay. Because for me, this is quite boring, so I'd like to mix it up. But if you guys are interested in it, then just tell me and I'll talk about it. Like, when something interesting's happening, I'll always talk about it, because that just makes sense to me. But when I'm doing things like this, I have no real interest in talking. So, yeah, I'm going to tell stories this episode. But if you guys don't enjoy that, just remind me in the comments and I'll stop. But yeah, I was going to say earlier, once my sister, it was like, we were quite young. We were like, she was eight, I think, and I was nine. And um, she caught this fish that was like the size of my dad. Obviously, she didn't reel it in alone, but she she did a lot of the work. Like, she got it pretty close to the boat to the point that we could see the main fin, which was very surprising. But she's quite strong. Like, even, f like, for a kid her age, she was really strong. It was quite fun to watch, and it fed us for, like, ten nights after that. Not immediately, we don't eat the same thing night after night. But, like, over the course of a few weeks, we ate it, like, ten times before we ran out. And that's not even including what we gave to friends. Like, yeah, it was so good as well. We've got this lovely... Sp um, fishing spot just down the road. It's like a short little bike ride, maybe five or ten minutes away from our house. And it's a creek fishing spot. It's not got very good fish to eat because they all taste like mud because they're all, um, what's it called? The fish that eat at the bottom of the sea. I don't know what they're called. I normally do. I've just, I've just forgotten. But yeah, so they don't taste very good, but it's, so nice fishing there. It's nice and quiet. Nobody really knows about the spot. It just, it's really nice for me. Um, okay, so as you can see, I've sort of been increasing the sizes of the areas as I go along. Here, I think if I moved all of these walls out one, then it would look a bit better because that, uh, from three to one, is a bit short to me. I'd like to go three, two, one, but it's okay. I really don't want to put in that extra work, so I'm probably not going to. I'm just going to leave it like this and start building the roof. So I'm going to pause the video, search it, what beehives look like, and then unpause. Anyway, pausing now. Okay, guys. I'm okay, back. guys. By I'm back, guys. By the way, Okay guys, it's been a day, I decided I am going to work on this a little more, but then after maybe we start on the top of it, I'm probably going to turn this off and yeah, and I'll continue this build in another video if you guys are enjoying it. Anyway, I'd like to uh, keep speaking about stuff to you guys. So, for anybody who doesn't know, this was recorded in... 
I think, yeah, the 11th of the 6th, 2020. I suppose you wouldn't know that because it's uploaded in the future. Um, but yeah, I'm very excited for this channel. I hope you guys are too. And again, I'm willing to play anything you guys want, or not necessarily anything, but most things you guys want to see, I'm going to play for you. And yeah, because I, ah, I'm not going to get into it. But basically, I spend a lot of time in games anyway, so I figured why not use the time that I spend to make myself happy to make other people happy as well. But if you guys want to see anything, just let me know. And yeah, after this layer, I'll probably stop. And I was thinking last night, I'm actually going to use slash fill rather than placing. So slash fill there, there, there. Two. Way down here. With honeycomb. So there, that was built. So now I can do the same thing. Fill. That's the wrong thing. Slash fill. Oh my god. Fill there, there, there. To over here. With honeycomb. There you go. So, also, again, anybody who wants to see it, I can play Minecraft Java. Um, I've currently got rounds open. I was playing with a friend, but he's just going to AFK for a bit, so I decided to get in a little bit more recording. Um, and if earlier in the video, I believe I listed uh, all of the games that I'm going to play for you guys if you want. So, just tell me if there's anything you want to see. Also, I would like to say, while I'm probably repeating things, I'm not doing it on purpose. It's because, um, again, this is the next day, so I'm, and I've not got the greatest memory, so I've probably forgotten some stuff I've seen, or some stuff I've said, sorry. Okay. So this is pretty good. I'm going to say, let's end the video here inside of the beehive and i'll catch up with you guys i suppose the next video should come out in the next day so like tomorrow another video of this will come out most videos won't be this long this is going to be the longest video i have because um because this is a weekend or yeah on weekends my videos will be maybe 30 minutes on a weekday 10 to 15 minutes Anyway, goodbye and have a wonderful day.